Women like men who are about four years older, who manifest signs of success, as well as being handsome and personable and all of that. The reason for that is that they're looking to equalize the economic disparity that exists because women take a harder hit from sex and pregnancy than men. They're looking for someone who's competent and generous. Competence would be intelligence, general cognitive ability, and the markers that go along with that. They want conscientiousness or openness, as well as other desirable personality traits. So they're looking for someone who can provide, well, it's not because they're greedy, precisely. It's because they're going to put themselves in a more vulnerable position if they have a child. And we know this because even affluent women who have a child by themselves or who get divorced tend to drop down the socioeconomic hierarchy a fair bit, which is, of course, why alimony payments and all of that are necessary. So this hypergamy means women are much more selective in their mating than men are. And it's not surprising because they pay a bigger price for sex. It's more dangerous for women because they can get pregnant and it might be more dangerous emotionally.